All right, hello everybody, I'm Ryan with Tech Smash, and we are here with Smilegate to talk about their revolutionary mobile platform, Stove. And so I've got Gehan Song, Shelly Song, and Kevin, uh, who are going to be speaking with us today to talk to us a little bit about it. So Gehan, tell us a little bit about what is Stove exactly? Tap is a global platform for mobile games, so it's open for developers. So developers can integrate our Stove platform to service the game and offer the game with social graph that comes within. Okay. So tell us a little bit more about the social elements of Stove. Mm. And this is a and just to clarify, this is a platform that will allow gamers to unite. Correct. Mm -hmm. When we talk about social graphs, it means it's interaction between contents, not the human beings. So we want um, different contents to be interact with each other um, on our platform. So we call it social Gamer network. Yeah, gamers network. The gamers network. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's the interaction of content. What are some examples of content that you guys are? bringing together using your stove platform. Uh, so some of the example of social graph is that you can invite your friends to do the dungeon um, stage together and form a party in the games and also you can you'll be able to chat with your friends in game and also you can use your address address book to add more friends to play the game together. Okay, so it's networking people together in game. Mm -hmm. So it would be a, a mobile version of like PlayStation Network or Xbox Live. Is that a fair comparison? Yes. yes. Okay, great. What are some things that you guys are doing that might be different from PlayStation or Xbox Live from a social aspect? Um, I think obviously the biggest difference is, is our user base is much broader. Um, for like PS or Xbox, you can only interact with people who own the device. But for Stove, you can interact with anyone who owns the mobile device. So the interaction can be much broader and easier in that way. And is this available on iOS, Android? Is it available on Windows? Any platforms on Amazon. And Amazon. Yeah. Any wow. platform that exists in mobile. And how many games to date do you guys have that support or are a part of the Stove platform? Uh, so we just announced this platform two weeks ago in okay. Korea. So we now have are talking to 20 to 30 game companies um, to bring their games to platform. And and after two weeks, we are here at E3, so we are right. just announcing this platform in the West market. So we are looking for more partners to go with and grow this platform together. We are not just platform developer, we are also game developer and publishers in Korea. So we um, have more than 10 mobile games that we are trying to release in the market through a stove platform. So we have our own games that's going to be yeah, released through the platform. Gotcha. So you guys will have your own games that help launch the platform, mm -hmm. and then you yes. guys are also partnering with other people. Mm -hmm. um, and it sounds like this is you guys are just coming to the West. What are your launch plans in terms of Korea versus coming to the Western market? Mm -hmm. Well, there is no really priority between the regions and markets, um, but of course we understand there are cultural limitations. So. You know, Asian players will have a little difficult time to interact with Western players because of language limitation. So um, we want to see more interaction growing from Asia and in the West. Um, so as Smilegate is based in Korea, we want to grow this interaction originally from Korea and expand to Southeast Asia. And we will also want to make a partnership with Western company to grow some interaction in the West. Sure. Uh, so that doesn't mean that we are going to divide the market and regions on our platform. Um, but users will be still be able to interact with from Asia to East. It's not a problem, but we we think that there will be more active interaction between the same regions and same cultures. Okay. And is this platform available today, or when will it be launching in the Western market? 
platform? Um, so we already started <coughs> to use this platform for our own games in Korea a few months ago. So it's ready for people to use for third-party um, developers. Um, but it's just a matter of time, like when and who will integrate their games with our stop platform. So, but it's pretty much ready yeah, okay. to be used. So it's ready for the Western market. You're just waiting for developers to take yeah. hold of yeah. it. Yeah, right. Excellent. Uh -huh. Okay. Great. Um, so that really that puts you to, that that pits you up against Apple on the iPhone with their Game Center, right? What are your plans to differentiate yourself from them? Uh, um, so that's what's really good question because um, one thing that we want to make sure is not we are not competing with the you know, previously existing social graphs like Game Center and Facebook. Actually, we are supporting this feature in our platform. But what we are trying to do is to you know, help the developers to easily integrate all these social graphs that's necessary for their games through our platform. Okay, excellent. Well, thank you guys so much for your time. We're really excited about Stove. Um, keep it locked to Tech Smash as we'll be providing more coverage at E3 here. And uh, as you're gaming on mobile, keep your eyes open for the Stove platform to socialize and to uh, play together with your friends.